What is up guys, this is the first video I do for a player review. Like I said, every week I'm going to be trying to do a player review of a new team of the week player. Now before I get into that, this could be my last video before I move house. Also, you could expect my player reviews to be much better than this, but I'm in a rush because, you know, everything is so hectic around here. But I wanted you to know what this guy is like before you purchase him this week, before he's out of packs. So this guy, let's begin with his um, card stats. 93 pace, 75 shooting, uh, 75 passing, 91 dribbling, 40 defending and 40 heading. Now the downsides of Inform Giovinco, his shot power is crap. Like, don't even try taking powerful shots they're not good um, he has a very very weak long pass it's not it's not really good so if you're trying to long pass it to your strikers it does the job but sometimes it could be inaccurate and he doesn't have very good vision so that is that is one of his main downsides also the biggest downside is he's really weak but he has 99 balance which is awesome 99 agility as well and that is fucking insane also if you love to finesse it this guy has I think 93 or 95 curve 95 curve I was like wow and you guys love how I, I I love to finesse so this guy is awesome to be on the team and also you guys know Sonic don't you you know Sonic everyone knows Sonic this guy is faster than Sonic himself 93 pace so so fast I could just pass anyone just using pace especially you know that guy what's his name Puyol Puyol is just fucking shit in this game I don't even know why he's raid so high I just run around him also if you love to take free kicks this guy is awesome at free kicks he has really good free kick stats people so if you love to take free kicks and you don't want someone that's so shit and slow like Pirlo you could have Inform Giovinco awesome free kick stats if you love to if you need someone that takes good free kicks on your team short passing he does the job i had never saw like him do an inaccurate pass but sometimes he might do and sometimes he might not also um other than that like i said long passing he's not that good vision wise he's not that good but his advantages is pace definitely pace his balance because even so when someone tackles him he reacts very quickly, he doesn't fall. He's he's got really good balance, 99 maximum balance, baby. His awesome free kick stats, no good powerful shot. That his shots are pretty inaccurate. They they barely hit the target if it's outside the box. But his finishing also is not that good, guys. But everything else, like I said, what you need from a cam is pretty decent. And his price range is probably like 70k and up right now. I've gone for 85k on the first day he came out. I probably got lucky. And he's been there in my team because I love him. I love the non, the non informed Giovinco. The inform is just insane. You guys have to try him out. Let me know in the comment section below what team of the week play you guys have tried out recently and what you guys think of them. If you've tried out inform Giovinco, let me know what you think of him. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me remind you guys that my player reviews are going to be much better in the future. Hope you guys enjoyed it and have a very nice day.